uh, acoustic similarity again to cluster music. Um, and uh, so what, what's happening is in this interface is we've uh, classified all this music based on how it sounds. We're positioning it into a three-dimensional space using a multi-dimensional scaling algorithm. So all of those balls that are songs, they're colored by the genre, they're being positioned based on uh, uh, how similar they are. So we use this as a way of browsing around a music collection. So here's a, here's a, a song, I can click on it, I can listen to it. So I can look around. So this red arc here is the rock part of my music collection. This blue arc here is the classical part of my music collection. So I can look around in here. If I hear something like that, I can say, hey, go find me more music like this. And go off the rest of the collection and get more stuff. So um, one of the things you, you can see here is um, here we have some songs. Here's a red ball that's near the blue ball. So that means we have uh, a song that's classified as rock but it's actually near the blue zone, so we can listen to it. Wait, maybe that's an optically close. Yeah, let's try this one. So, you can see how you could use this type of uh, visualization to help you uh, uh, identify outliers and then explore your music collection. But one more thing, when I wake up in the morning, I like to listen to uh, really soft music. Uh, so there's a lot of really good ideas 